A high profile trial getting underway this week. Now, former police officer Kim Potter faces first and second degree manslaughter charges in the death of Dante Wright. Wright was shot and killed during a traffic stop in Brooklyn Center. Potter says it was an accident. She meant to use her taser instead of her handgun when trying to stop him. Shayla Reed joins us from the newsroom this morning. And Shayla, a trial that people all over the country are going to be watching. That's right. And it's video from that traffic stop. Attention from coast to coast. Tomorrow, jury selection is scheduled to start in the trial of Kim Potter. It's expected to last for a week. Opening statements are scheduled for Wednesday, December the 8th. Judge Regina Chu says cameras will be allowed inside the courtroom citing the pandemic. We spoke with criminal defense attorney Joe Tamburino, who's not affiliated with this case. He says finding an impartial jury could be tough, even if the case is moved out of Hennepin County. The question is, can you set aside the videos and the reports and everything that you may have heard about the case and try to keep an open mind and be impartial throughout the trial? And we learned potential jurors received a 15 page questionnaire asking about their knowledge of the case, media habits, police contacts and opinions regarding the justice system and treatment of people of color. Again, that jury selection process gets underway tomorrow. OK, Shayla Reeves, thank you. Okay. CBSN Minnesota will provide context and legal analysis as we did during the trial of Derek Chauvin while we live stream the Kim Potter trial to download the app. Scan the QR code on your screen right now. You can find CBSN on your favorite streaming services.